Hey, what's up guys? Rev here. Now I'm not going to waste any time and I'm going to cut right to the climax. The second season of Uzaki-chan Wants to Hang Out has been officially announced. Give yourselves a round of applause, everyone. We did it. Despite all of the controversies, all of the problems, all the crying from all the Tumblr refugees on Twitter, we have seen the second season announced. And it's a great feeling. Now, it's not surprising to get excited about the announcement of a second season of an anime you enjoy, but this one, I take a personal pleasure in this one. Because myself and a lot of fellow YouTubers spent a lot of time addressing the bad takes and the awful controversies people were trying to spin on the series. I mean, we witnessed the chest of this character nearly caused World War III, okay? It was that big of a deal. And despite all of their screeching and noises, the series still succeeded. There was no shutdown, there was no censorship, there was no backing down. It just went on as planned and it succeeded. Because honestly, I don't think they ever planned on having a second season. And because of how the first season went, and because of all the popularity and attention it got, they announced the second season. And that's probably due in good part to all of the negative attention it got. These people unwittingly promoted the shit out of this anime. Now personally, I believe this anime probably would have done pretty well on its own without any sort of extra attention on it. But the way it was handled on social media, and the way it stirred things up so much and promoted this anime over and over and over again, is the reason why we're getting a second season. And I would imagine that this anime exceeded their expectations. And one thing I want to explore here is the fact that the first season happened, right, the episodes are coming out, and then the controversy kicks up. At that point, they can't really do anything about an anime that's already finished. What I think is exciting is, with the second season, they have plenty of time to plan out things, and hopefully, and I pray, meme on and make fun of all the people that are outraged. And I hope the studio responsible for this is smart enough to understand that they can trigger these people and bait them into more attention. They should really be trying to do this a second time because it would be just as effective, I'm sure. But either way, I'm really excited to see this. Now I understand that me and other people who defended this series on YouTube, you know, we're not the ones responsible for season two, like not at all. I mean, if you do scroll far enough down the article, you can see a personal thank you to myself. But besides all of that, the reason we're getting a second season is because so much support was given by the fans. And I know some people are like, oh, Rev, the, the, the show was stupid, the plot was bad. Yeah, no kidding, it's a slice of life, okay? You don't go watching hentai for good dialogue, okay? And honestly, it was good to see a series that had a controversy and it really just got handled really well and people just stomped all over it. Because in 2020, we need that kind of stuff because people are outraged about everything. But that's all I really got for this video. Thanks for watching, everyone, and I'll see you next time. Thank you.